Hi guys, I'm going to try and copy Lid Motors version of Blades simple heat engine. So you're going to have to look at the video description for links to the original videos. What we've got here is the plastic bag uh, that some coffee came in. It's quite a thick, stiff plastic. So I'm going to see if that will do the job. I'm not going to try and explain what it is yet. You're going to have to watch the video. First thing I'm going to do is cut a strip from this and then hold it in front of some heat and see if it bends. Well, I put it in front of the light to give it some heat and it did bend a little bit but I'm not sure whether it's going the right way or the wrong way. So I'll make a little rocking arm for it and we'll see what happens. To make the arm I'll use this bit of plastic um, trellis from 99p store for no reason other than it's handy. something for it to rock on. So a couple of bent paper clips I'll stick onto here. I think I've got a knitting, uh, sewing needle I can push through there as the pivot point. A couple of bent paper clips. Uh, couldn't actually find a sewing needle so I've got a bit of wire across there going through my arm, rocking arm. I haven't worried about balance yet. I'm not sure which way round to fit this. I'll just pop a little bit of hot glue on it I think. Probably a bad idea but I'll do that and stick it on there. I'm not sure whether it should be that way round or that way round and whether I should have the the black on the inside or the outside. I'm beginning to think it ought to be on the inside. One way to find out isn't there? Try it and if it doesn't work try it the other way round. Right, I'm going to have to bring the camera in a bit closer so we can see what's going on. I'm using that paper clip as an adjustable balance. So we need it to be just about balanced and then when we heat up the uh, whatever we want to call this thing, the wing, the arm, uh, the piece of plastic, it bends and that alters the centre of gravity. So I'll move the camera and then we'll put the light on it. Right, at the moment As you can see, just rocking a tiny bit. Put a 
put some heat on it. Let's see what happens. Rising. Take the heat, heat away. difficult to tell whether it's working or not. Right, bit of a redesign. I've made a much longer lever arm so it's more visible what's going on. I've got the same plastic packaging you can see as it gets warm it straightens up that brings the centre of gravity further this way tipping this end down as it goes out of the light it cools down and curves back again so the centre of gravity goes back I suppose I'll do it in sequence it's heating up, centre of gravity is coming this way out of the light, cools down they curl back again, centre of gravity goes back that way, heats up, centre of gravity comes this way, drops down, out of the light, cools down, there we go. Not quite as efficient as lid motors but certainly the principle is working and that's good enough for me the camera a bit so we can see that plastic bending or curling. So make sure you check out the video description for the links to Lid Motors version. And I think on his there's links to the chap Blade, I think his name was, who was doing the original. I could sit and watch this all day. I love it. The only downside is you can see the mess my desk is in. Still, that'll do. Job done.